हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू अवर चैनल इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस व्हाट इज सी रेट इन बैटरी व्हाई सी रेट इज नीडेड एंड व्हाट इज द बेनिफिट ऑफ नोइंग सी रेट एंड हाउ टू एस्टिमेट दिस सी रेट एंड एट द एंड ऑफ दिस वीडियो आई विल शेयर वन फ्री टूल वेयर यू कैन एस्टिमेट दिस सी रेट सो गाइस यू वॉच दिस वीडियो टिल एंड लेट मी स्टार्ट दिस वीडियो एंड हियर यू कैन रीड सम इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट्स रिगार्डिंग सी रेट सी रेट इज नथिंग बट how much time your battery pack will take to discharge completely from 100% to 0% or vice versa okay how much time your battery pack will take to charge from 0% to 100% with the help of c rate you can decide okay here you can read some points regarding c rate a c rate is measurement of the rate at which the battery is discharged comparable to its fully capacity okay full capacity and then if your battery pack c rate is 1c okay that means your battery pack will take 1 hour to discharge or charge completely a 1c rate indicates that the discharge current will discharge the old battery in 1 hour okay later uh, i will tell you okay how to calculate one c rate c rate calculation everything that time you will understand what is one c two c those things and you can read third point a battery charge and discharge rates are managed by battery c rate okay then battery c rating is a measurement of the current at which battery is charged and discharged okay fine and this point you can read this is very important the capacity of the battery is generally rated and labeled at the 1c rate okay normally the battery is rated at 1c rate this means the fully charged battery with a capacity of rated capacity of 10 ah should be able to provide 10 amps for 1 hour okay suppose if your battery pack is 1c and rated capacity is 10 ah then this battery pack will discharge completely in 1 hour because it is 1c and the rated capacity is 10h and it will provide 10 amps of current for 1 hour okay 10 amps of current it will provide that same 10h battery being discharged at a c rate of 0.5 okay suppose if your battery pack is 10h rated capacity is 10h and c rate is 0.5 then your battery pack will provide 5 amps of current for 2 hours and if it is discharged at 2c rate it will provide 20 amps for 30 minutes suppose if your battery pack is of 2c rate then it will take 30 minutes to discharge okay and if your battery c rate is 1c it will take 1 hour to discharge completely and if your battery pack c rate is 0.5 then it will take 2 hours to discharge completely okay you can see in this table a uh, different c ratings and time suppose if your battery pack c rate is 30 c rate then it will take 2 minutes to discharge completely and if your battery pack c rate is 20 c then it will take that sorry 3 minutes to discharge completely and if your battery pack c rate is 10 c then the old battery pack will take 6 minutes to discharge completely or to charge fully from 0 to 100% or vice versa well it is clear if your battery c rate is 5c then the old battery pack will take 12 minutes to discharge completely or to charge fully from 0 to 100% if your battery pack c rate is 2c then it will take 30 minutes to discharge if it is 1c it will take 1 hour and if the c rating is 0.5c then it will take 2 hours if your battery pack c rating is 0.2 then it will take 5 hours and if your battery pack c rating is 0.1 then it will take 10 hours and if your battery pack c rating is 0.05 then it will take 20 hours okay let me share with you how to identify the c rate of the battery how to find the c rating of the battery here you can read some points 
normally C rating will depends on the load. Okay, C rating will depends on the load, but in some cases you will find C rating on data sheet or bat on battery pack you will find. Okay, C rating always depends on load. Okay, for example, okay, uh, your battery pack is of 10H rated capacity. Fine. And your one registry load is there, which needs 5 amps of current. It is taking 5 amps of current. Then guess what will be the C rating now? Okay, as per this, you can see the C rating will be 0.5 because your rated capacity is 10 AH and your load needs just 5 amps. So your battery pack can provide 5 amps of current for 2 hours. Here you can read this point. At the same 10 AH battery being discharged at a C rate of 0.5 C will provide 5 amps over 2 hours. Okay, C rating is uh, depending on, it is always dependent on load. Okay, if your load varies, then your C rate will vary. C rate is not fixed. In some cases, it is fixed for small applications, that time it is fixed. But in large applications like in EV, electric vehicle, okay, car, scooty, in other applications, high voltage applications, that time the C rate is not fixed okay let me take example of electric vehicle sometimes you will accelerate sometimes you will deaccelerate okay that time the c rate will be different sometimes the battery uh, will deliver high current sometimes motor will take more current sometimes it will take less current so c rate is not fixed c rate always depends on the load this is just constant when the load is when the register load is fixed Okay, this load needs just 5 amps of current, but your battery pack rated capacity is 10 AH. Then this battery pack will provide 5 amps of current for 2 hours. And suppose if your resistive load that is fixed and it needs 10 amps of current, then your rated capacity is also 10 AH. Then it will provide 10 amps of current for 1 hour. Okay, let me share some formulas to calculate the time okay here you can see suppose here you can see the uh, 30 c rate example you know c rate and if you know rated capacity then you can calculate the time okay what is the time of discharge how many minutes it will take to discharge completely you can calculate with this with the help of this formula here you can see the example of 2C rate. You can use these formulas to calculate and 4.5C rate. I think C rate is clear for you. And if you have any questions, any doubts, you can ask in the comment section. And wait a minute, I will share one free tool where you can estimate the C rate. Just search on Google CS Electrical and Electronics. Wait a minute. Yeah, wait a second. Just search CS electrical and electronics. And here at the menu at the top, you will get tools option. Just click on tools. Then you will get some tools like battery pack sizing online calculator, then battery C rate online calculator. Just open this. Just click on this link and here you need to add your rated capacity suppose your rated capacity is 10 ah and your load needs just 5 amps of current then here you can see the c rate is 0.5 and the total discharging time in hours is 2 hours and in minutes it is 120 minutes with the help of this tool you can estimate this c rate and suppose if your battery pack is 20H and you need 5 amps of current, then that time your C rate is 0.20 and your 
discharging time in hours is 5 hours and discharging time in minutes is 300 minutes now i will keep load current as 20 amps and rated capacity 20 h then the c rate should be 1 c here you can see the c rate is 1 and the discharging time is 1 hour and in minutes it is 60 minutes with the help of this tool you can estimate the c rate of the battery just you have to enter the rated capacity and the load current i hope this video may help you all a lot thank you for watching this video have a great day